You got Lindsey Vaughn coming up on the podcast coming up. Mm-hmm. Um, what was that like? How did you, how do you know? Like how did that happen? That connection. <laughs> how did I how did I get her as a guest? Yeah, and how, <laughs> how do you even like just like how does like somebody you can just pick up and just call on the phone with just randomly? Just being in certain environments over the years, whether it's SB awards or whether it's any any award show or any, anything where all athletes you know kind of meet in, yeah. in certain spaces, you have certain people that you look at their greatness or what they accomplish, and you are a fan. And so I was a fan of Lindsey Vaughn without knowing anything about skiing. <laughs> I don't know how to ski, but I was a fan of what she's done because of what she's overcome. And so I'm someone who's overcome a lot. And so I'm always, my heart goes to the people who are overcoming. And if you, anyone to get a chance to understand the, the injuries that Lindsey Vaughn has overcame on live TV in front of the entire world, um, that built my fandom with her because I know how tough it is to come back from a meniscus tear or ACL tear, but she came back from tearing every part, all of them. So once I got a chance to be around, I, I'm, I'm the kind of person to very be like, yo, I'm a fan. Gotcha. Like, I ain't I ain't trying to be too cool. Like, I'm a fan, and this is why I'm a fan. And so we built a relationship off of two people who have overcome something, and then you get to know the person. And so getting to know the person, um, I realized how cool she was, how dope she was, but also, too, we both are in the same space in life where we kind of retired from our sport at the same time. And so we're two people who are trying to figure out the next stage in life. And so we bounce things off each other, and we support each other in that. So we have a very good relationship from that standpoint, um, even investments. If it's some investment that comes, she'll send it to me and say, hey, what do you think? And vice versa. So we have a, a, a good rapport from that standpoint. And it's all built off of respect of what we've overcome. Right. And so it was so cool to be able to sit and have her on a podcast um, and to be able to ask questions about that. Um, and just to be able to expose this audience that are listening to the why to a sport that a lot of people don't have a lot of history in when it comes, especially when it comes to the black community, when it comes to skiing. Right. So uh, I thought it was just a great conversation to be able to have with a friend, but also someone who is the GOAT in the sport that she chose to play. 